In health news, heart attacks have increased in America over the last three years, and there appears to be a connection to the COVID pandemic. Is COVID infection a risk for heart disease? Current research indicates that might be a possibility. Our medical expert, Dr. David Winter from Baylor Scott and White Health, joins me now to discuss it. Good morning, Dr. Winter. What is this link that we're hearing about between COVID and heart disease? Well, heart disease continues to be the leading cause of death in this country, but there's been a big uptick since COVID. Now, most of those cases are in people age 65 and older, but also younger folks are coming down with heart attacks. And it looks like a heart attack from COVID occurs while you're infected, but there's even increased risk for a year after the COVID infection leaves your body. How could COVID uh, cause heart disease and what would that link be? Yeah, we're not exactly sure, but the leading culprit, we think, is inflammation. I've got a model here I want to show you. The thought is most of us have some plaques in our arteries of the heart, and if a plaque is inflamed by COVID, for example, that plaque can then have a clot on top of it, and the clot then blocks blood flow to everything down below it. So all the muscle below that is damaged with inflammation. Hmm. Is this related to myocarditis that has been reported in young men? That's a good question, but that's an entirely different disease. I'm going to bring my model back. I was talking about clots in the arteries. Myocarditis is inflammation of the heart muscle itself. That's a different thing. That was initially reported in young men aged 12 to 29. So we're seeing more of that in older folks now also. It's still very, very rare. And you can get it certainly from a vaccine. That's rarely been reported. But new information says you're more than eight times likely to get it from COVID itself mm. than from the vaccines. We need to put that into balance. Oh, yeah. What are you recommending for us uh, to your patients to protect them from heart disease that might be related to COVID? Yeah, of course, try not to get COVID. Be careful in crowds, especially indoor settings. Good idea to get regular boosters of the COVID vaccine. That does work. And then the risk factors for heart disease. You got high blood pressure, high cholesterol, high sugars like diabetes, also obesity, smoking, lack of exercise, all those are important. Minimize those, you minimize your risk from heart attacks from COVID and from just general heart attacks as we're seeing in America right now. Okay, always great information, Dr. David Winter. Thank you so much for joining us. Always good to hear from you.